Hello my loves and welcome back to my channel. It is Rona Cole here back with another cleaning video. The temperatures have finally dropped and fall is in full effect. What better way to start the new season than with a clean house? So if you have not already subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below. Also hit that notification bell so you are notified every time I upload a video. We are going to start this cleaning video with some laundry. A lot of times I will do laundry in the morning and then throw it in the dryer when I get home from work or I put the laundry in the washing machine before I go to sleep and throw it in the dryer before I go to work. This particular day I did a load of laundry before I went to work and now I am throwing those in the dryer. Those pink dryer balls I picked up from Dollar Tree. I'm going to grab Christian and Caleb's clothes and throw those in the washing machine. I was actually a day off of my laundry schedule. I usually wash their clothes on Thursdays and my clothes on Fridays, but I'm not sure what happened. This all fresh and sensitive smells so good, y'all, and the smell lasts forever. So now I'm back in Caleb's room just picking up things that need to be picked up off the floor. Caleb is constantly knocking down these mirrors. He stands up when I'm getting him dressed in the morning and just grabs the mirrors off the wall and throws them on the floor. grab a Clorox wipe and wipe down everything in Caleb's room. We have all been suffering from some random cough. At first it was Christian and then it was Caleb and now it is me. So I have been going through the house and disinfecting all of the doorknobs, uh, remotes, phones, everything, light switches, everything.
tell, but I'll be holding you. So of course I can't have a clean video without a pop-up from Caleb. So now on to our bedroom. Like I said before, I do a lot of laundry either early in the morning before I go to work or late at night. So in addition to starting a load of clothes, I actually had put my clothes on hangers and folded all of my stuff up and just left it in the floor so I could pick it up when I got off work and that is what I did. For some reason it is so much easier for me to fold laundry in the morning. I guess I'm not like fully awake and I can't overthink it or get annoyed by it. So I just sit down and do a load of laundry before I go to work and knock it out. Just to know what you knew Christmas every time we start locking eyes up. So much stuff accumulates on this dresser, it is so annoying. So I keep my sheet sets in a pillowcase so everything stays together. That way I'm not looking for a pillowcase here, a flat sheet there. So you see me keep trying to like push up against the mattress to get it to move. Y'all, this mattress is so 
heavy it would not budge can you of course, what is a clean with me without Caleb moving my tripod? And there is my husband. Yes, he does exist. And he's actually putting up his laundry. I cannot believe it. Now I'm just going in and vacuuming the carpet. I love vacuuming carpet, you guys. I do not know why. I think I like the carpet lines. That's what it is. So initially I was going to clean my room, Caleb room, and help Christian clean his room. But y'all, I was getting so winded from moving around and I had an upper respiratory infection. Y'all, my chest was hurting. I was like, I, I can't do this anymore. So this is actually the next day. I woke up early that morning and started a load of laundry. I also helped Christian clean his room. I didn't film that, you guys. I'm so sorry, but it was just like, I woke up and started cleaning immediately. I am washing the sheets off of my bed and also Christian's bed. And yes, my washing machine has an agitator and I love it. And here is Caleb. He has become obsessed with trying to plug things into the plugs, which I hate, which is why we have all of our plugs covered. So here is a glimpse of the way Christian's room looked before. It was a hot mess. And this is it after I made him clean it up. I went ahead and vacuumed it myself. And this is all of the dirt and dust that came out of my vacuum from vacuum in Christian's room in the hallway. And this is the number one reason I hate carpet. So as you can see, there is a lot of dirt and dust around the edges of our carpet near the baseboards.
So I decided to go in with my Dyson and the crevice attachment to get that up. And of course my Dyson died because I forgot to charge it. And that is it you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.